Danielle, thank you so very much, and thanks for being so forgiving of uh, technical difficulties. I'd like to know what advice, tell me, well, first of all, I want to know what's new at Bumble. Well, Bumble BFF is a friend-making mode of the Bumble app, and people right now, they're searching for connections, especially with Friendsgiving coming up and the holidays, we're starting to have that top of mind. And so people are looking for ways to be resourceful about inviting new connections into their lives. So give me some tips or maybe some advice you have for someone who's looking to make new friends and they want to socialize. Yeah, well, you know, as adults, the biggest thing that we cite as a barrier is time, not having enough time. But there's just too much research that points to how important friendship is to our overall health. And so we've got to prioritize it. And research tells us that repeated exposure is such a critical part of the friend-making process. So we're going to have to be intentional about sparking those connections and uh, putting things on the calendar. And then the second tip that I'd give to an adult is, you know, I like, I know we like to feign confidence as grown-ups, but a lot of us are secret scared of rejection, but there's research. It's called the liking gap. And the concept shows that we tend to greatly underestimate just how much people like us in the first interaction. And so it's important to muster the courage to put ourselves out there. Well, Daniel, my audience is a little more seasoned. And when I say that, it's made up of 89.9% baby boomer women. And a lot of them weighed in because I told them you would be here. And they say that at this point in their life, they're not making new friends. Tell me the overall value of, of making new friends and happiness and well-being maybe in that age group. Well, yeah, it's so important in, in any age group, but especially, you know, as folks get, you know, a little more seasoned and experienced with life. I mean, people who say that they have strong support networks are living longer. They're saying that they're happier. And it's actually, according to research from 2020, maybe the number one preventer of depression having somebody to talk to. So regardless of where you are in your life, we have to find a way to, to believe that friendship is important because it is. With this new BFF, how do, are we connecting to people all over or, or in a limited area? Tell me how that works. Yeah, Bumblebee Effect is great for finding people in your area if that's what you're looking for, especially if you're new to the area. And, you know, it pairs you with people who are like-minded. You can use features like profile badges, which allow you to signal what's important to you. So do you like to exercise? Are you interested in the Zodiac? You know, a third of the members report being new to the area and they want to match with people they can explore the city with. So there are a lot of things you can do to connect with people who are near you that you can actively go outside and engage within a meaningful way. Okay. I'm going to take this one real quick from Instagram. They want to know what makes Bumble different from the other apps. Well, I'll tell you, Bumble BFF is so intentional about communicating from the very beginning that they value genuine connections, that they want it to be a safe space, that they want to support you in building healthy friendships. And it really is kind of, it's the number one, as a friendship coach and educator, it's the number one um, place of technology that clients have told me they have used to find real genuine friendships. And so I champion it as much as I can because I have seen firsthand the success story. I want to thank you so very much for coming by and inspiring my audience to make friends and to get that BFF app and get some find some new friends, guys, or find some old friends on Bumble. Thank you so very much, Danielle. I really appreciate it. Have a great morning. Thank you for having me. Hey, I'm Valder Beebe. I broadcast on radio, streaming TV, podcast, and in print publications. I interview the world's most fascinating authors, all because I love a good book. This summer, I've partnered with WPS for BB Summer Book Giveaway. We're giving away New York Times bestsellers and award-winning books, books that inspire me and I'm sure they'll inspire you. To be eligible to win a copy of Jesus Can Give You a New Life, answer this question. What is God's greatest gift to mankind? You'll find the answer in John 3.16 of the Bible. Send your response to the email at the bottom of the screen. I'm Valder Beebe and I'll see you for the next Beebe Summer Book Giveaway.